Is it true that the Saudi authorities are destroying the <laughs> Islamic historical sites? For instance, the shrines or, or anything in Mecca and Medina. And if it's so, if it's true, why is it? Okay, very good question. Again, uh, revise my f previous question of I do not represent Saudi government. I wish I, I did, but I don't, alhamdulillah. Fadlallah Azza wa I never assumed any public post and I will never inshallah because for your religion, for your heart, the best thing is to be away from them. Secondly, this question comes usually in an offensive way. See, when you're speaking with someone and he says, did you do, do this? He's pointing the finger in, in UK. If you point finger, this is disrespectful. They become very angry. Don't point at me because you're becoming offensive. But I'm not in, from the UK, so alhamdulillah, it's okay. This question is posed in an offensive way. Is it true that Saudi is demolishing shrines and uh, historical sites? I said, okay, okay. I have little knowledge. Enlighten me. Educate me. Okay, what do you want me to say? Um, what are the sites that the Prophet ﷺ considered as shrines and the companions um, glorified and made it as a mazar? Huh? Mm. I don't understand your question. No, I said you didn't understand my question. At the time of the Prophet ﷺ, was the house of Khadija, may Allah be pleased with her, a place of shrine or a visiting place or something sacred? No, because the Prophet went to Medina and his cousins took all of his wealth. They were kafir. So when the Prophet conquered Mecca again, did he repossess his property? He said, no, he left it for them. So what do you understand? Yeah, yeah, but uh, there are Islamic shrines. Okay, what do you mean by Islamic shrines? You mean a place where the Prophet ﷺ urinated and people started think, uh, praying there and taking it as a mazar and baraka, baraka, baraka. Everywhere, everywhere I go, people rubbing me, baraka, baraka. Use toilet paper. Why are you rubbing yourself in me? This is white soap. Don't, don't touch me. Baraka, baraka. Everything is baraka. So they're accusing Saudi Arabia again. Okay, okay, why are you accusing Saudi Arabia? Because they don't like the Prophet ﷺ. They demolish the uh, house of Khadija, the house of Fatima, the... Um, what else? Tell me, remind me, I don't know. Uh, graves, of the graves of the Sahaba. They took the Sahaba and... Akhi, this is, you're crazy. <laughs> graves are very sacred in Islam. We're not allowed to disturb the people who died. We never disturbed any of the Sahabas, of the companions. They're buried where they are, in al Baqir, in, 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 in Medina. In Mecca, we have two big graveyards, and, and it's there. Nothing of, of such. But these so-called super Sufis, they want to distract people from Kaaba. No, no, don't go for Kaaba, go for this. And like the Shia, don't go for Kaaba, go for Qum or Najaf. These are more sacred, 70 times better pilgrimage to Mecca if you go and visit the grave of Al-Hussein. Okay, where is Al-Hussein? He said, well, we have in Iraq and we have in Syria and we have in Egypt. MashaAllah, what is this franchise? <laughs> How can this be? Some say, no, his head is in uh, uh, Iraq, his body is, his legs. Okay, this is nonsense. This is total, yani, nonsense crazy but they say these are sacred places sheikh if you go to al hussein in egypt you feel the tranquility and the iman if you go to iraq allah answers all of your questions well, this is not islam the islam i know this is not islam we have quran and sunnah this is not part of islam so in short there is nothing as such that it's saudi is demolishing this and why and what do you want me to tell you that they hate islam and they hate the Sahaba and this is nonsense. There are nothing as such as Islamic shrines. We have Arafah, we have uh, uh, Mina, we have Muzdalifa. These are the Islamic shrines we have and they're only visited five days a year in Hajj. Other than that, it is nothing.
It's like it is remaining because we are complying with the Sunnah, and Allah knows best.